Welcome to my channel. I'm Inspirox and I'm, this is Daily Rambles. Today we are doing Arrow Season 1 episode I think 15 or 16. It's called Dodger. So this is going to be about the jewel thief and um, basically security basically stole it because he's wearing an electric um, bomb collar that the jewel thief uh, puts around his victims because um, Technically, he doesn't touch it or he doesn't steal it. And so that happens. And then he sh um, takes off the collar once he steals the jewel and basically shocks him. And then we have the flashback scenes where Slade has an infected bullet wound. And then we jump back to the present and Moira talks to Frank. She wants out and he kind of wants out. So... Um, we're t they're trying to figure it out on what to do. And then we jump to Oliver, talks to Felicity to come back up to the team. Because first she said, I only help you find Walter. Then she says, ah, I'm done with this because you're killing people. That's not right. So then um, the then we cut to a scene where the Dodger, um, and t um, let's see, um, meets up with a broker in Starling City. And this one is not a nice, well, he's not great. He says, like, if I remember the correct codes, it's in, like, the the jewel in, like, to the offshore bank account. And it's like, let's hope I don't forget my numbers. And so he just shoots them. He's like, oh, okay, bye. <laughs> and then we cut to a scene where Oliver and Felicity are talking strategy. Um, and about like how to combat this art thief. So she decided to come back on the team for just, I think, for this one time. And then Theo, she's still working at, um, at Laurel's um, place of work. Uh, the, I don't say the free law clinic, that's like that I can think of. And so uh, she's walking with Laurel and then um, someone stole her purse. And then we jump to Oliver Bugs McKenna's phone. Uh, before I do that, um, my fingers are first on. They did try to catch a tip of guy, but he jumps over the fence and gets away. But he leaves his um, chain wallet chain. Same way, then when Oliver Bugs McKenna's phone when he was with his store, then awkwardly asks her out on a date. And then we have a flash, and she says yes. So then we cut to a flashback scene where. Um, so Oliver um, says Slade has infected bullet. He goes back to the cave to get the herbs that Yalfe gave him when he first got there. And a random person, or just a random person, pops up in the cave saying, like, it's all tied up. He's like, blah, 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 help me, blah, blah, blah. And then um, we cut to the present. And then um, we get to date night, and it's awkward for Diggle. And it ends early because he brought up his dead brother, which he used to be married to the to the lady she's trying to date, Carly. So that does not end good. And then we get to Oliver's date, which um, she is asking a lot of questions. And I mean, a lot of questions about like, where'd you go? How's the island? What'd you do for food? Who'd you meet there? What happened? And he's like, uh, no, <laughs> I don't want to answer. And But the end's early because of work. And then we go back to flash that scene where um, the random person skills some type of staff story, like he was on the boat, the engine died, he's been stranded for days, then he pops up here, and there, and so, okay. Then we cut that to present, and the Dodger um, meets with another broker, but the police have to be in with that, with Arrow, but the Dodger got away. So um, they have... <laughs> Basically, uh, Felicity is talking about, like, how did you all the states go? And they're like, <laughs> fine. So they went bad. <laughs> and then um, then uh, the person that stole the as well, it turns out to be Roy Harper, which is his intro. And then he gets arrested. But he gets a sap story, so Thea's like, just let him go. It's just a damn purse. And then uh, we cut, uh, then the, um, Team Arrow 
basically figures out on um, how to um, lure the do lure the Dodger out. <laughs> Can't even talk right. And so they uh, lure him out by um, putting up some jewels that the the Queen family owns. And so um, Felicity's um, also helping out, sticking out the place and stuff because she put GPS in the jewel. And she looks very, very hot. Like, very hot. And so, um, so Dodger steals it, but um, Felicity confronts him, which was kind of stupid. And then uh, Felicity has the bone collar on, and she can't tell police, otherwise it'll go off. So then there's a car chase, and a really good car chase. If y'all know me, here's one thing y'all should know about me. I love car chases so freaking much. Motorcycle car, it doesn't matter. I love it. It's amazing. I just love it. And so then Oliver gets him. Basically, he... Um, he shoots an arrow into one of his nerves where he can't use his thumb. Like he uses, he um, he cuts the nerve that operates the thumb so he can't press the button to set off the bomb. So um, so then Oliver deactivates the collar and uses the electric stick on the guy and knocks him out. And then we have the flashback scene where Oliver decides not to help him and leaves. Basically, he was, um, Taking up too much time because he was trying to help Slade, and he was like, okay, I can't deal with this. I'm sorry, bye. So then uh, we go back to the present where Diggle and Carly kiss. Uh, then Thea confronts Roy, and then Roy does give back her purse. Then Oliver apologizes, apologizes to Hall. Then we have the flashback scene where Ollie is conflicted about what he did. And then we catch at a final scene is where Mora hires China White to kill Malcolm because she was out. So, really good episode. I really do like it. The only thing, I'll give it an A. Not an A plus, but an A. Most likely also maybe like almost a B. Just because the whole uh, guy in the cave thing, I didn't care. <laughs> I really didn't. I understand, I understand why it was kind of important, but I didn't give it. I didn't give a crap. And I thought that was just kind of like a waste of time, but um, other than that, it was a great, great episode. So that was literally my only complaint. So that's why I give it. It's, it's poor between a B and a very low A. I'll probably give it like a, I don't know, like a ninety out of hundred. So anyway, it was a really good episode. I really did enjoy it. Again, they're expanding the character developments, and they're going to keep doing that throughout the rest of the first season and probably throughout the entire series, pretty much. But um, I like how things are going. I really do like it a lot. And I like how Morty's getting starting to get a little bit more shadier. I'm trying to get a handle on stuff. So I appreciate that, appreciate that as well. So um, that's one do it for me. If you like this episode, give it a like. If you don't, dislike. Tell me how to do it in the comment section down below. And comment on what you want to see next. And then subscribe for more awesomeness from me. And I'll see you on my next video. Bye, everybody. Oh, 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 o